her Taiwan, but now I'm gonna be sure to make small paper, paper airplanes just fly fast. You need small paper like this. Size is 6 inches by 5 inches. Oh, 7 by 5. Maybe. First, you're gonna hold it like this. Okay. Hold it like this. Cross. Hold it across. You can use square pen papers because you gotta leave the space over here. And fold it across again to the other side. To make a point, to make an intersection point like that, then you fold it like this. You see, and fold it like that. This is your paper, and it doesn't look like this. Then, well, it may do even you use bigger papers, but not the square ones. Now, now for the wings and the wings, you gotta fold it. You gotta, you gotta fold it diagonally like this, then to the other side. It must be equal for the person to fly equally in space. Then, we need to put some weight in front of the airplane. We must bend it over. Hold. We must hold it like this. Now your paper, your paper airplane must look like this. Then, we fold it into a But the other side must be the folded one, like this. Then, you must leave at least one half inch for you to hold when you go and apply the Paper airplane. So flying ninja. You can use this while even you're in the class, because the teacher won't notice, and you can put some messages. I will demonstrate how you fly it. Flying ninja. But wait, I'll try. The airport. Amazing. Amazing. It's amazing. But do this again. Oh, so amazing.